So this is the bubble gem. It's used to circulate and oxygenate the nutrients in your tank or grow system, basically killing two birds with one stone, doing the job of a water pump and air pump kit at the same time. Inside, we've got an instruction sheet. We've got the main body with suction pads at the bottom that are used for sticking it to your tank. We've got the air filter, which will stop anything nasty from getting in, any contaminants that might cause issues, root diseases, etc. We've got two bits of 13 mil pipe, a short one which is used to connect to your pump and a 1.5 meter length that's used to connect to the air filter. You'll also find some cable ties to help secure things in place. Pumps are purchased separately. We recommend going for something like an MJ750. You'll need plenty of pressure to get the, the full effect of the oxygenation. So you're going to want to be moving at least 750 litres of water per hour. It's pretty simple really, just attach your pump to the main body using the short bit of pipe. This is where your cable ties come in. You can wrap one around each end to keep things locked in place. Again we've got the air filter, simple as to set up. Just attach it to the body using the longer length of pipe and make sure that you position it outside of your tank. When you turn your pump on, it's going to push water through the main body and out through the two holes. Thanks to something called the Bernoulli effect, it'll suck air in through the filter at the same time, keeping things very heavily oxygenated. By drawing air in from outside, you'll help to keep the nutrient solution cool, which is good news because roots don't really like temperatures over 21 degrees C. Anything over that can start to promote the growth of pathogens and cause root disease.